Do you want to make the iPhone overexpose HDR footages and turn them like this normal footages? Well, in this video, I'm going to teach you guys how to do this in Premiere Pro. Let's get started. Hi guys, I'm Pizza Sammy. I made assets on video editing, photo editing, and all those things in Premiere Pro, Final Cut Pro, and After Effects. So if you guys are interested on this kind of things, then do make sure to subscribe to this channel and comment down below. So for this video, if you have taken an overexposed video from an iPhone in an HDR format, and if you guys have drawn it into Final Cut Pro or Premiere Pro, you guys will see that it is in overexposed format. Why is that? Because it is in a very different color space. Now, few days back, I did the similar video for Final Cut Pro, which one of you guys commented that you guys want to see a tutorial on Premiere Pro 2. Well, here it is. So in order to do this trick in Premiere Pro, you have to do two steps. Once you have taken the footage, drawn them in Premiere Pro, made your sequence, you guys have to do two things. The first step, make sure the sequence is in Red709 format. To do this, go to the sequence panel on the above panel right here. Once that is done, go to sequence settings, go to video panel and color workspace should be at Red709. Once that is done, and the second step is to change the color override of your footage too. Then right click on the footage, click on modify, then click on interpret footage. Once that's done, go to the bottom panel right here make sure to keep the color override to red 709 whichever format the video is in it will override it into the red 709 color space and the last step which is an optional step but a crucial one in my opinion is that once you guys have taken the HDR formats into red 709 the colors will be a little bit off especially skin tones so make sure to adjust the colors a little bit more in the limitry color panel make sure to increase the saturation in the hue panel make sure to play with the HSL panel add a little bit of contrast to the video too and once that is done the final result is ready just to be clear this is just a tutorial on how to turn the hdr into normal footage is not exactly a color grading tutorial but if you guys want to see a lot of more LUTs videos i have tons of LUT packages on my channel which you can check it out i'll link some down below as well with that being said if you guys like this kind of videos if you guys like the content i produce then do make sure to comment down below like this video and i'm pixel sammy i'll be back with a new video soon peace out